So what did you just say? You're gonna open this thing up and what? What's gonna go that way? The juice. The juice? Yeah. So it goes through all of these? Yeah. How does it do that? I don't know. Papa? What? Can I open the thing when it thing when it's time? Yeah, I'll let you. We'll do it together. Hello. So this is how it cooks? Yeah. Okay. I'll show you here in a second. Okay. The juice comes in here. It goes back and forth. Down that pan all the way. And when it gets to the other end, it's cooked. It doesn't take long, I guess. Well, well, does it take a long time to go through all this stuff? It takes a while. Oh, okay. you got to have your heat right. A lot of different things to go on. How does it, how does it keep moving? Like, it seems like it would just stop. <laughs> well, the juice keeps coming in. It just keeps pushing it this way. <laughs> Uh, you gonna do all the work, buddy? You are? All right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Am I warm? I just need to get this much taller and then I'll be taller. <laughs> Hey. Hey, Creeper. I didn't even know you were staring at me. I got about a full moon and I take that plank and it's mounted up here. Yeah. It takes 50 tons on Yeah. That's a good impact. I was just asking about the frame, so. I love my room where the TV is. Yeah, my uncle made it. And we used to cook it in his, his house. And then we tore it down, brought it over here, and set it up. And been cooking it here for the last several years. Of course, we hadn't done it in about 12 years here. Yeah, we've been we've been married 12 years, and I've never seen y'all do this. So I don't know how long it's been. Kevin said he thought it'd been 14. Is this supposed to go under? It will somehow hit the ginger. Sydney, would you drag the water hose down here? <laughs> Oh, I got some water in the back of Have you already had a hot chocolate this Honeybee shirt, come around. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
Why are we adding water? We're going to start out with water. Mm -hmm. Used to, I was running the juice all the way down to here. And then when we got it cooking, I had to keep pushing this back. Ooh. To get it Ooh. cooked right. Yeah. So I'm going to try using water to start with. Just like you do that every time there in the water. Um, it's about two thirds full. Honey Somebody run me a little more water in this bucket. Put some water in it. Is there, yeah, is there any in it? There's a little bit in there. Go ahead and pour it in here. I want to get this boiling good back here before I let the water out. It's Good there one time. Yeah. I, the secret to the wood is probably just put a little bit in, in at the time, not just pile it full. Yeah. And that kind of smothers it down. Turned it over to me. So. Oh. <laughs> if it ain't done, it's Kevin's fault. Oh. If it ain't done, it's Kevin's fault. <laughs>
This was our only sweetener. Molasses? Yeah. It's not molasses. It's <laughs> sorghum. Sorghum syrup. Can we not just call it molasses? I can. It's good. It's very sweet, isn't it? Can you believe this came out of stalks of stuff? Very <clears throat> good. Or, you know, discovered that one day. <clears throat> Let me press all the juice out of this, cook it, see what happens. I'm sure they just chewed on it and not eat it. Sweet. sweet, yeah. Didn't have sugar. <clears throat> Well, we were too tired to wrap up our video yesterday after all the activities of the <coughs> sorghum cooking. <coughs> so, we'll wrap it up today with Adam eating a molasses biscuit. Thank <laughs> you. 